Hey guys, welcome back to the Honda Resource. Today, on this episode, I'm actually gonna be going over some of the differences and features on the first generation Honda CRV. Uh, so I'll sh at first, I'm gonna show you several features that you may not know exist on the first generation CRV. If you own a first generation CRV, you may know some of these, but you may still not know some of them. So let's get into it. All right, so our first little thing we're gonna look at got some stuff going on in this one that I'm currently working on. Um, let's see if we can get, well, I guess the first thing we can look at is this piece here. Uh, sometimes you can find this piece in the cargo area. You may not know what it is. Don't throw it away. It's actually to go on the cylinder right here and it holds your tailgate open. So uh, in the event you're like parked where I am on this hill to where it's trying to close on me, you put that in there and it holds the door open. Number two, uh, we're gonna go mm -hmm. in the, also in the back here, under this cargo mat. We're looking for this. This right here is a table, all right? It's a collapsible table. So we'll put that down, pull this up. And voila, we have a table. Infamous CRV table. It's also said that this hole in the middle is for holding an umbrella that was also optional. I have never seen the umbrella, um, but you can see that is Honda CRV. Uh, this first generation is a little bit shorter than the second generation CRV, so the 02 to 06 table is a little bit taller, a little bit bigger. Then this table, I actually have several of those that I actually use in my shop. Um, all right, so the next thing, uh, this area here, as you can see in this case, is being used as a storage, but it can also be used as a cooler. So basically what they made, it's a sealed off compartment here, and the jack is actually supposed to be under, under here. But you can see they've got it here in this little area here. But usually they have four little tabs that basically they're just little push pins. So it's got one, two, three, and four so that you can remove this and uh, dump the wastewater out. So that's three cool little features right here in the very back. We've got the door holder. We've got the collapsible table. And we've got the little cooler storage compartment. Okay. I think this is probably one of the coolest features that probably a lot of people don't know about and the people that do know about it really use them a lot like i said i have probably three or four that i have that i've acquired over the years from the junkyard that i use in my shop on a regular basis all right next now this feature is not available in all crv trims and i know that um like this one is a, this one's like a uh, 99 EX. So it does have the the, uh, the bed conversion capability to lay flat into a bed. Like say if you're, if you're camping and you wanted to um, actually camp in that, that's what these vehicles were meant to do. All right, so uh, first and foremost, what we'll need to do is this little lever here, right here on the, side we'll pick up on it we'll pick up the seat right until it locks see how it raised at the bottom and it locked and then we'll pull the this we'll pull that up and lay the back flat right until it locks just like that we'll lay it flat Usually there's all kinds of junk and stuff under those because people don't clean it out. All right, and then we'll need to remove the headrest. So just pull it up and then you push in this tab to get the headrest out. Now I think you're supposed to be able to lay it flat right here. Okay. And then you'll slide this seat all the way up using the lever here. Okay, so we slid it all the way forward. All right, and now we have to lay it down. All right, so 
once I got to lay down, you see it lays back all the way to where it's almost a seamless transition. So, effectively makes a bed. So you can do that with both sides. And you can see how it's just straight down. So both sides do that. Now, like I said, some uh, versions of the, the CRV didn't have it. So some of the LXs and probably some of the 97, 98 didn't have this feature. Um, you see there, both of those are laid down. Okay, we'll take this headrest off. I'll lay that headrest down there. And then we'll slide this seat forward. Okay. And we'll lay it back. And there we have it. It's a pretty nifty little feature. But bet you didn't know that, did you? If you did know that, drop a comment below. And let me know. Also, all 99 to 2001 Honda CRVs in the US had this exact color. There was only one color option available, and it was this. You have a 9901, I guess with the exception of the SE, because the SE had black leather. Or maybe it's dark gray leather. I think it's dark gray leather. Yeah, dark gray leather. Um, but if you had any of them besides the SE from 99 to 2001, they have this exact pattern exact color only option available and I'm pretty sure that the SE was only available in 2001 and it's hot out here so I'm just setting up these seats again put them back like they go I was working on some other stuff on the CRV and I was like hey let me, this would be a good opportunity to film this video I've been meaning to do this video for a while it may not come out the best because I am pretty drowsy but Hopefully it does. Hopefully it does. We're actually about to list this CRV up for sale as a 99 all-wheel drive um, automatic. Just bought it uh, maybe a week ago. Maybe. Fixed a couple issues with it. And now we're about to put her back up for sale. Man, my neighbor over here and their belches. Alright. Moving on to all right, moving on to some other feature that you may not know exists on the first generation Honda CRV, and that is a storage compartment beneath the passenger front seat. So I've seen several that uh, either was missing the tray or didn't come with the tray originally. Uh, but this one has it, so I figured I'd show it to you. So it actually just pulls all the way out, like so. There's some little tracks in here on the bottom of the seat that it actually goes into. It's a neat little place to store like some of your documents and stuff rather than you know, occupy all your glove compartment. And then also, this little center table here, while it has those cup holders, they're not very efficient. And there's a guy that 3D prints a, a piece um, that goes on here and has like a little storage for your phone over here. And it makes these taller. And if I can find his uh, Instagram or whatever, I will link it in the description because it's a really nice piece if you have one of these because it'll hold your drink. Um, but anyway, there's a little handle right here. And I'll lay that flat. So that's pretty cool. Um, and then the automatics, you can see the auto, this is the automatic version. So the automatic version also had these two cup holders here, but they're pretty crappy again because they're shallow and just don't hold anything. Uh, the manual actually had a, a storage cubby here, which is a big open pocket. So, um, but yeah, that's a few things on these. And then also while we're talking about the color variations for the interior, this one over here is actually a 97, 98. And 
you can see the lighter color gray that was available in 97 98 now this was the only color option available in the 97 98 it didn't come in any other color these doors are squeaky i need to grease them up or something but this is the only color option available for the 97 98 so and you can see this one doesn't have that option of, well actually yes it does I was just say this one doesn't have the option of making the bed, but it actually does. It's just the trim here is over the handle. But if you have the handle on the side of your seat, it'll make the bed. Otherwise, it won't make the bed. Let me walk over here and see if this one's also an EX. Let's walk over here and look at these other ones. I think I've got several of these first generations here. I've got like 11 CRVs here total. Um, so you can see second gen CRV, second gen CRV. There's another first gen CRV that I gotta put back together. This is also a 97, 98, but see, this is the LX. You can tell because the door handles aren't painted. It's locked. Hold on. Let's unlock it. All right. Unlucky. Whew, look at the ants. Hmm. All right, so you see how that one doesn't have a handle here. So that's a no tilty. All right, so while we're talking about LX and EX, so this, and we're in the shade. <laughs> the CRVs came, for the first generation 9701 came in three trim levels. You had LX, EX, and SE. Like I said previously, the SE, I believe was only in 2001. It had uh, paint matched bumpers. Some of them had like a tire cover, a hard tire cover as opposed to the soft tire cover most of these come with. Leather interior, so leather seats. Uh, it seems like there's something else, maybe a leather wrapped steering wheel. I don't know, that's, that's the, the highlights of the, of the SE there. Um, but otherwise, all the drivetrain and stuff is the same. The SE did not come in manual. So, um, LX and EX did come manual. And uh, I think the front wheel drive was not an option in 97 so all 97 crvs in the u.s are all-wheel drive and all right so to tell the difference between a ex and a lx so the lx has black mirrors black door handles the regular door handles on the inside and that may be it besides the seats you know being able to fold down uh, but like the uh, the EX has paint matched mirrors, paint matched handles, and then has a chrome plated actual door handle here. Not this piece out here, just this piece here. All right, let's walk down here and look at this other CRV they have. There's another second gen. I got a bunch of cars here. All right, so this is a another first gen this one it's also all-wheel drive and it is an ex see how it's paint matched i know they're black but they're actually painted and you can see there it has the, the handle so that one will will fold down let's see second gen second gen we got another first gen over here and this one's a lx front wheel drive and that one will not fold. It doesn't have the handle. So this one, like I mentioned, is a, I think this is a 99 LX. And we got another second gen over there. My handy dandy golf cart. <clears throat> um, so yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight nine and then i have the two over there that i was using for the video so, 10 and 11. It's pretty crazy crvs are popular man but yeah that, that one will also fold flat though uh, but like i said this is uh the only interior option available for the 97 98 to where the dark grave is the only interior option for the 9901 with the exception of the SE.
and also the EX has a uh, aluminum wheels or the LX has steel wheels so I guess that's another way to tell so I think that's gonna wrap up our video showing you some of the features and options that are available on the first generation Honda CRV now I do plan uh, to do another video showing you the major flaws or common issues or problems that the first generation Honda CRV has. I've already highlighted a good bit of those uh, through doing repairs on my channel. So if you're interested in any of those common um, problems that the first generation Honda CRV would have, just look at the playlist on my channel and he'll go through many of those repairs. Um, but we'll cover that on another video. So it's hot out here. I'm going to close these up and try to go in and get a little bit of a rest in the AC. So thank you so much for checking out the channel. I really appreciate you stopping by. I hope you stick around and check out some more. Subscribe to the channel. Leave me a comment below. Let me know if, if you knew about all these features or if there was something that you didn't know. As always, I appreciate those likes and I hope to see you on another video soon. Be sure to check out the website, thehondaresource.com. I've got all kinds of OEM fluids on there and aftermarket parts if you need anything aftermarket for your CRV. Thanks again. We'll see you on the next one. Peace.